Hey, hun, my friend has two immediate work from home positions, 4k bonus slash weekly and monthly income. Comment below if you want to take advantage of this amazing opportunity. No, we don't. And the OP titled this damn MLMs are now calling it a work from home position. I mean, they've been doing that for a real long time, even since before the pandemic. By the way, the OP also checked out the Huns page and it's clearly a weight loss gummy MLM, but she is very careful not to name the company. She knows people are gonna run the other way as soon as they hear it's an MLM. Hello, Redditors of the Internet, Noble Z9 here, and welcome to r slash Antimlm part 87. Let's get started. So, we may have just found the most patriotic hun in America. Here in America, we vote with our dollars. With more and more companies pushing their woke agendas, we decide to spend our money where it really matters. We have certain values we refuse to compromise and support brands that align with those values. American values. Do you vote with your dollars? I found an American-made store that's kind of like Amazon where everything is shipped quick to you and Target rolled into one but more affordable and better quality and with a lot more American flags slapped on them. You know, at the end of the day, companies really only have one agenda, and that is profit. They're there to make money. And by the way, I found not one but two of these Huns, including this one who mixes cleaning supplies and beef in their sales pitch, which is an odd combination to say the least. I'd say this makes about as much sense as Colgate lasagna. All my essentials except for toilet paper and dinner from a company that truly cares about people more than profits, all made in America. And I love that everything is greener, cleaner, non-toxic, and safer for me and my family. My meat aficionado brother is very excited for our first beef delivery later this month from the same company, Best Beef in America. No joke. Hashtag wellness advocate, hashtag shop American, hashtag ditch the toxins. This hunt claims to have found an American-made store, kind of like Amazon where everything is shipped to you, but more affordable, which considering the MLM business model, I highly doubt. I'm absolutely loving it, hard eyes. And now everyone is her bestie all the time, and I hate how mom shame these posts feel, like someone who has a real job isn't a good mom. A lot of these huns have some screwed up logic. Blessed that my bestie and I both can make our own schedules and have these times together, cause that's what it's all about. These boys will only be young once, and I refuse to miss it because I have to punch a time clock or because I'm married to my job. I didn't have kids so someone else could raise them or have them always be alone. Because all their mom does is prioritize work over them, I had that done to me and I will not do that to my boys. Being able to be home and there when my kids need me is the biggest flex of life and I thank Ariel every day for this. Honestly sounds like you're trying to take advantage of moms who want to spend more time with their children, particularly those who have to work to provide for their family. And now, does network marketing pay all my bills? No, not yet. It's coming though. Network marketing has made me a thousand air laughing emoji. You really don't need network marketing or an MLM for that. Has earned me four all paid vacations and has completely changed my mental stability in two short years. And in six days, my hubby and I will be on trip number five as we set sail on our first ever company cruise. Not only did I earn myself a spot, but I earned myself a balcony and I get to bring my man. Does your company do things like this for you? Cause if they don't, you need to find a company that values their people more. Question about those vacations, do you have to go to any kind of meetings or seminars? Or do you have to pick up your phone and make some sales while you're there? If so, it's not really a vacation. If not, just disregard what I said. I will be the first millionaire in my family, mark my words. How can you be so sure? It doesn't happen overnight, but I am determined to help change and heal this world one person at a time. And you can help me too. I am ready and waiting for you. Who's ready to take a chance on themselves? Here's the problem, if no one responds, you won't be able to build that downline. So it's gonna be a lot more difficult for you to become a millionaire. And now remember that retreat Grimace hosted for her Bravenly Huns last year? The Pine Multi Bunk Bed Bedroom Slash Dungeon? Well, they're doing it again. How can those on the lower blocks of the pyramid afford all this? 
I don't think they can. I really hope they're not going into debt for this. Months ago, we started working on our next team retreat. Wow, so exciting. I'm not new to hosting retreats. This will be the 12th one I've hosted in six years in the industry, and they're my absolute favorite thing ever. And the most dedicated Huns will probably try to make their way to all of them. It's a special way to let our team know we love them and appreciate them. It's a unique opportunity for us to celebrate them, heart. Team culture. It's something we will never compromise on. It will always be our main priority. It's something we take great pride in, and it's at the forefront of our minds with every decision we make. From prior ventures, we know what it's like to be unseen, unheard, and unappreciated. So, we go above and beyond to provide the opposite. And we love doing it. Hundred, to our retreat earners, we can't wait to celebrate you in a few weeks. Are they really celebrating you, though? Or are they celebrating their own company? Hmm. And now this Melaleuca Hun is being passive-aggressive towards her friends slash family members. Wow, Melaleuca Huns are everywhere today. People always warn you to be careful on who you add on Facebook. But to be honest, I've noticed strangers sometimes support you harder than the ones you know in real life. Strange. Are they really supporting you, though? Or will they leave you the moment they stop making money off you? That is the question. Hey, if you're enjoying this video, then why not like, subscribe, and hit the little notification bell? And now even AI thinks MLMs are wrong. ChatGPT says, sure, here are some specific things you should avoid doing if you want to earn money in an ethical and responsible way. And it's not Number one answer? Pyramid schemes or multi-level marketing. These are schemes where you make money by recruiting new members to the scheme rather than by selling a product or service. Pyramid schemes are illegal and even some MLMs can be predatory and harm people's finances. Well, there you go, even the AI is speaking facts. And now, let's make a deal, Sensi Edition. A Sensi hun messaged me about the upcoming vendor event that we are both a part of. Hey girl, I saw that you're a part of the vendor event that I'm a part of. Of. I'm a Sensi consultant, and you sell wax melts, so let's have a friendly competition. Yeah, now that Huns are here, I would rather be a part of the event the way you've spelled it as one word. Anyway, let's see what this challenge is. If I sell more online orders count for this week, you join me as a consultant. If you sell more, I'll place a $100 order with you. Deal? Hmm, the terms of this don't seem very fair since you get a whole week of online sales, while the actual small business vendor only gets to count sales at that event. At least that's what it appears. And by the way, the OP sent an email to the event coordinator. Hi, I wanted to bring up an issue that arose. Soon after you sent out the list of vendors, I received a message from one of the vendors attempting to get me to join in on a deal with them. Attached, I have provided the screenshot. This person is trying to solicit me into joining her multi-level marketing scheme, and I do not appreciate this being done. I hand make my items, and I do not like that someone deemed my items compared comparable to the items that they sell in mass from a large corporation. I don't want any conflict during this event, and I've been very much looking forward to it. I hope that this person has not messaged anyone else to try something like this with. It is not okay for this person to do, and it is ridiculous of them to try. I look forward to hearing back from you. Thank you. And then the event coordinator responds, Hi, thank you for bringing this to my attention. I will handle it right now. Well, and after that, the hun is not happy. What the hell? I just woke up with an email saying that I'm not welcome at the event anymore and my money was refunded. It was a simple deal. You could say no. It would be nice if this could be resolved with a simple no, but the problem is you're going to try to rope other people into your MLM, and that's something that shouldn't be done at events like this. So that's why a simple no can't do, hun. And now the one that got away from Scamway. I have scheduled a MG2, but it becomes a no-show, so moving on to the next. They missed one of the best opportunities of their life. Time and opportunities are two things that you can't bring back. The only way from here is forward, and you're already doing it. In other words, they were able to escape the manipulation of the cult, brainwashing to the extreme. And John Camp 28 says, except if they messaged tomorrow saying they were interested, they would put them right back on the list, so the saying doesn't apply when the company is that desperate. That's true. They will take anyone in as long as you're willing to let yourself be taken advantage of and be willing to get brainwashed. Yeah, hon, it's not really the opportunity you think it is. And now, I knew I shouldn't have friended her. Hi, hon, just thought it would be nice to say hi. My last account got hacked and it was a nightmare. Trying to friend people I have mutual friends with and or know and start over. 
I am this person's sister in case you didn't know, I teach high school, but I also work for a health and wellness company on the side, in case you see any of my stories and wonder, haha. No one is interested in your stories if they involve an MLM, so I love to social network for my business. Anyways, just thought it would be nice to say hello, have a great week! Did your account get hacked, or did you get banned for trying to advertise on people's feeds? Don't even respond to anything like this. As a matter of fact, activate that block button. And now most of his arguments could be used against him. It's kind of ironic. Oh, we have a male hun on our hands. Most people will continually tell you why something will or will not work. Everyone has an opinion, and most people seem to be experts in today's world. People tend to have big mouths, judging eyes, a pessimistic mentality, and little to no results. It's funny to me when people have a hundred million ideas and opinions and so sure about what they're talking about and their lives looks like a tornado. You wouldn't take it advice from an obese person on how to lose weight, and wouldn't listen to someone making 47000 a year on how to become a millionaire. People, careful who gets in your ear about every area of your life. Be careful what content you consume. Your environment and friendships will determine your future, unless you have a mega trust fund or marry a multi-millionaire. Be careful about spending too much time with negative people who have low energy and complain about their situation. The world doesn't give a damn, and the marketplace could care less. Society is making everyone soft and making it okay to barely get by. It's a BS mentality. Mentality. You need to be healthy, fit, mentally strong, and go out and produce results. That's the bottom line. Be the one in your family who wakes their ass up early, stays up late, takes risks, and makes it happen. Because remember, you're not really in that hustle grind set unless you're up early, sleep late, and deprive yourself of sleep. I desire a perpetual flow of happiness, health, love, financial abundance, fun, adventure, and results in my life. I am happy when I give it my all and do my best. Happiness is found when you live life on purpose and make yourself proud. God bless. And by the way, this individual also attacks people for not being successful enough or working in a 9 to 5, and he gives the fault to anyone not being successful with IM, as in IM Academy the Forex trading thing, because they are just not hustling enough. If you're successful at what you do, that's fine. If you're shaming others for not being successful, that's not fine. At that point, you're just being an ass, especially since you just don't know other people's situations. By the way, the dude is from Europe, but is using dollars in the post. Hmm, I wonder if that's because he was copy-pasting. And now we have an unhinged paparazzi rant on Craigslist of all places. Paparazzi jewelry live shows. I have been selling paparazzi jewelry for five years. I'm so sick and tired of these people that order jewelry, but they will not pay for it or respond back. Five years ago, it was easy to make $65,000. From paparazzi? I doubt it, unless you're like at the top of the pyramid. Now there are just so many that waste my time when they know they don't have the money to pay for it. I'm continuously blocking people on Facebook due to their ignorance. I let them shop all week and then send them an online invoice on Saturday evening they have until Monday morning to pay. I have heard every excuse in the book. I didn't know my light bill was due, my child support didn't come in, I don't receive my social security until the third, so why waste my time? I'm trying to make a living just like anyone else. And yes, I am on social security, but damn, what happened to respect? Hell, you don't go in Walmart and pick up everything you want and then go to the cash register and say, oh, I can't pay for it. Pissed at online sales. And some burnt toast says, just browse, no pressure, then they do this when you browse. That's why nobody browses, because it's never just browsing. Especially with Huns, they really want to push that sale. And now pretty sure everyone gets this generic email when they level up. Level up? What is this, a new MLM gamification effort? Congratulations, executive brand partner. Hey, hon, congrats on reaching executive brand partner. We are so proud of you, and we are delighted to be on this journey with you. We know that you have been working hard towards this goal, and today we celebrate you. We are cheering you on as you soar to new heights with gratitude founders Aspen and Brent. It's Monday, and that means payday for so many of us at Bravenly. But this 
This is what made me smile this morning. This generic email. I woke up to this super sweet and encouraging email from our founder slash CEO congratulating me on my recent rank. Damn, I guess those huns were wrong when they said I would be the CEO. Y'all, the fact that our CEO took the time to email me when they're busy running an entire company with hundreds of other members, that meant the world to me. This company cares about their people. They care about you. I have been so blessed to be a part of this and I'm so excited to continue to see where this journey takes me. I would love to have you join me too. Let's be brave together and make a healthier life physically and financially for ourselves and our family. Get in my messages and let's chat. Hashtag payday. Hashtag ranking up. Hashtag goals. Hashtag striving. Hashtag live brave. Hashtag bravely global. Hashtag this company cares. Hashtag this company doesn't actually care about you, they care about money. Ah, oh, poor Hun actually thinks this is a personalized message and not just an automated message that's sent to everyone who ranks up. And now for this next one, we don't need inventory. How much do you think this was bought for? Then explain the one, two, three pictures full of inventory, adding up to 2,700 sets that are now being sold at a bargain price. These color street nail strips must go. Most are retired and all are wrapped in protective sleeve. Shipping depends on number of sets ordered. Please do not claim here until contacting me for an inventory link. No longer a stylist, just selling off my stock on hand. And by the way, it only ships for a dollar. Though no return, so once you buy it, you can't get your money back. Wow, so Color Street made all the money they can from you, and you're left holding the bag. Who knows how long it'll take to sell 2,700 sets of Color Street nail strips. That is, if they even sell. And now, is Monet getting desperate? It's sale time. This hasn't happened before. 25% off site-wide. Oh, and the timer ran out, which means it's happening right now. Or the sale ended, either or. So you're telling me that they've never done this type of sale, even though I've clearly seen these types of sales done before all over r slash anti -malem, even from your company? Hmm, don't lie to me. And now, Amway Victim reached out to me on LinkedIn when he said, Coach, I knew something was up. He's red and I'm green. He starts us off. Hi. It's good to connect on LinkedIn. You seem to have a great background as an engineering technician. Are you open to diversification? I'm connected to a successful team of entrepreneurs who help professionals like you to leverage their spare time to develop online businesses and create asset-based income. Do you keep your options open to new opportunities? Hmm, I'm always open to new opportunities actually, but I'm very picky about the ones I take. I don't have a lot of spare time, but I would be at least willing to hear you out. Ah, uh, I understand. I was the same way when I heard about this opportunity. Are you available this coming week for a Zoom call with me and my coach to go over everything in greater details? Hmm, actually, I'd like to know a little more going into it. If it's some sort of freelance work, I might be open to it, but again, I want a little better idea of what this is before I pursue it further. Do you have some documentation I can review first? Why, of course! It's an online e-commerce type business where we help our partner companies like Home Depot, Apple, Microsoft, Lowe's, Best Buy, and many others to connect on a platform with customers who love to buy their products. Spelled T-H-E-R-E. -E. On the Zoom meetings, we'll discuss everything in greater details and answer more of your questions that you may have or come up with. I'm not really interested in a job in e-commerce, but thank you for your interest. Well, just to clarify though, this is not a job. This is a business opportunity where we help you build a large enough of an income to one day help you leave your current job and one that will put you on track to actually enjoy and live life to the fullest. Hmm, the more we go on, the more this sounds like a sales pitch. Oh, I'm not really interested in leaving my job. I like the work I do. I would be happy doing that work in a more independent fashion, but my skill set is not really applicable outside of an engineering environment. Additionally, this sounds like pitches I've heard from some MLMs. If it isn't an MLM and is something more legitimate, then I would be curious how my skill set specifically applies. If it is an MLM, then I recommend you run from it as fast as you can, because that coach? Hmm. People think about MLMs as selling and recruiting some people that have a working perception. Let's do a 20 minute Zoom call to explain the concept to you and after that you can decide if you want to proceed. Many of my business partners are engineers also. I appreciate the interest, I really do, but I must decline. 
Oh, I understand. If anything changes, let me know. In the meantime, you could check out my shop and let me know if there's any updates that could be made. It'd be greatly appreciated. Have a great start to your week, sir. On Amway.com slash my shop. Wait a minute, isn't that just the generic link? Oh, there's a little piece cut off at the bottom. Never mind. But still, run far away from so-called business opportunities like these. That business won't actually be yours. And now it's not a work trip if you have to pay to go to it, hun. A Kangen hun in particular. Ended the day with booking the next work trip, a place I never wanted to go again, but this is going to be too jam-packed to miss. Viva Las Vegas, multi-pure tour, their headquarters are there. Enagic two-day event followed by a three-day team retreat. Wow, a two-for-one special event and team retreat. And the absolute best part about work events, you get to travel and spend time with your friends, grow your business and your knowledge, and the trip is a complete tax write-off, showing some of the common self-employment tax deductions. Yeah, but even if it is a tax write-off, it's still not as good as it being free, especially not if your write-off is spelled like the opposite of left. And now, Scamway at the airport. Much fun. Hey team, had two offline connections at the airport. Also, booked three MGs for the next week. Hashtag two launches this month. And people replying with clapping emojis with heart emojis. Sounds like this may be a hun group chat. They are not gonna leave you alone. Not in the slightest. And now a message from one of my former students. Wow. Hey, happy face, I hope you're doing well. I have a little favor to ask. I've started a new online business sharing some products. I'm really trying to expand my network and get my name out there to more people. If I sent you a copy and paste post about a viral product, the post won't say you've used it, promise. Would you be willing to share it on your wall for me? Once I get a few sales from your post, I'd love to send you yours for free. White heart. Let me know and I will send you the info. P.S. This is not a scam, it is really me selling the product. It doesn't matter if you're selling the product or not, it's still an MLM, and that business model is still predatory. And now, hash tag facts according to a juice plus hun when you purchase her capsules you get a four month slash 120 day supply hmm now i'm wondering why you need to sell so much supply at once when many other places have options of a one month supply or two month supply can i share some facts with you about what happens during those four months as soon as you start taking them, it reduces the immediate impact of eating a high-fat meal, the narrowing of blood vessels from 40 to 50% to only 16%. Whoa, where's the proof of that one? Who knows? Within two weeks, your body shows the benefits of increased vitamin C and vitamin E as increased levels of antioxidants and micronutrients, including beta-carotene, which gets rid of the free radicals in your body. Free radicals are like naughty cells that run around your body damaging things and causing chaos. You need antioxidants to help keep them in check. Well, while well, free radicals can damage cells, they are not themselves cells. Anyway, your oxidative stress is significantly reduced. Oxidative stress damages cells, protein, and DNA and contributes towards the aging process. By day 28, your antioxidants and micronutrients are significantly increased in your bloodstream. Up to 2,000% increase in lycopene, which is a super powerful antioxidant helping you with heart health helps slow the aging process, and is just an all-around amazing antioxidant. By day 42, your folate levels are increased. More commonly talked about is folic acid. You need this to keep your red blood cells healthy. You've also got a higher resistance to bad cholesterol. Muscle emoji. Sources, studies, we don't need those. A muscle emoji. That really proves all of this is facts. By day 80, you're flying. You're flying? Who stole the Red Bull formula? You've got lower blood pressure, you've slowed your aging process down by almost 70%, your antioxidants and micronutrients levels are amazing, and you've built up an immunity to fight off cold and flu viruses. I promise you these capsules are the glue that hold me together, and when you order these for yourself, you'll get a fruit and veg chewies for children absolutely free! Please do not give MLM products to your children. And I cringe when Huns make all these medical claims without any kind of source, and no disclaimers either! I'm no lawyer, but I'm pretty sure it's illegal to do that. At least in the US. And now, girl I used to be friends with on Facebook, water curing blindness, wow! These Kangen machines are miraculous! 
I've been giving my neighbors some of my medical grade ionized water for the last three months. What does medical grade even mean in this case? His wife came over yesterday and shared an amazing testimonial with me. He has slowly been going blind in one eye. The doctors told him there's nothing they can do. He'll eventually just go blind. Well, the only change they've made in their lives is drinking this ionized water for the last three months and he said his eyesight is improving. Also, the wife said she had a cut on her finger that was hurting like crazy, so she put it in the water and it has stopped hurting. I'm telling you, it's miracle water. This is thanks to the anti-inflammatory effects the water has. They're super excited to buy their own machine at the end of the month. It's amazing what the right kind of water will do for your body. We are 70% water and our organs are mostly water, yet most people are drinking demineralized or contaminated waters. Thinking it's healthy and safe, but in reality, they aren't serving their body or contributing to health. I'd love to talk to you about this water and even share it with you too, so give me all of your questions. Ah, another one making all kinds of medical claims. And now this next one is copy-pasted all over. What is it named? Three? Do you ever wonder if when Amazon started, they thought they'd only sell books forever, or if they'd sell, well, almost everything? Amazon disrupted the industry because it changed the way people shopped, but it collided when it changed how people shopped for electronics and clothing and became the biggest retailer in the world. Here's the problem though, your MLM is not Amazon, so stop thinking your company can be like Amazon. Here's a great quote, collision. Unlike disruption, involves more than introducing a technological innovation or revamping the business model or customer value proposition. It's about the emergence of an entirely different kind of company, Heart. This is what I'm so excited about, what's coming next in my online business. By using the same kind of model as all kinds of different MLMs, but pretending it's different, we're already disruptive. We are getting ready to become colliders. If you have been looking at what I'm doing and thinking, I'm kind of curious or wondering what the heck is she talking about? It's time to chat. Let's have a quick convo either by phone, Zoom, or Messenger. Put a heart below and I'll connect. Kiss face. Collision in business is about the emergence of an entirely different kind of company. By the way, they're also being mysterious about what they actually sell. Just more pre-launch BS. And now according to this hun, we're already in a subscription without even realizing it. Wake up, sheeple! I was chatting with someone the other day about objections. Here is one of my favorites. I don't want a subscription. Okay, but you already are in one with Walmart, with Target, with Grove, with Amazon, with wherever you are buying your home essentials from now. You go to there every month, many times every week. You're giving a store of some kind your money every single month for these products. Over 63% of price of what you buy from Walmart or Target adds no value. It goes towards advertising, marketing, middlemen, and distribution and adds no value back to the product. Read that again. And how our business model is different, we make the Huns market for us for free. But you see our Huns aren't middle men, they can also be middle women. This box is shipped directly from the manufacturing facility in the USA straight to your door. So that 63%, it's put directly in a higher quality, cleaner ingredients. American flag. Oh, Melaleuca and your American patriotism. There are over 400 products to choose from and here are some of my favorites. Toothpaste, laundry soap, European standard makeup. Wait a minute, European standard? I thought this company was 100% American. What happened to our American standards? Are are they not good enough for you? And there goes all the so-called patriotic huns. And now, I'd like to thank all of my patrons, especially Amethyst Phoenix, Krangis McBiscopal, Dark Garden, Catalin Cormendi, Mike Cock, Hold Up, Nightcrawler, Stormcloud the Wolf, and Vicmeister1999, and Zoe Horsham. You can join in the link below, and if you enjoyed this video, feel free to like. If you want to see more, hit the subscribe button, and turn on the bell, and comment if you have something interesting to say.